You see a bunch of numbers and words on the screen, but none of it really means anything to you. I'm going to mash on the keys. Oh, dance with me, Boone. Dance with me as we leave the Death Claw Quarry. Boone? Oh, sorry. I think I broke him. Oh my god! Eddie? Eddie? Hey, Sloan? Sloan, guys? Yeah, I fucked up. Yeah, I fucked up bad. This was... This wasn't my... This wasn't my fault! Evening. Hi there. Hi. Let me just use your kitchen real quick. Uh... There we go. Well, ladies and gentlemen, say hello to our new companion. Isn't he just adorable? Ah! Die! Oh, not me! How the fuck am I gonna... I can't believe anyone actually made it through from the north, what with all the death claws at the quarry. Who the fuck are you? From New Vegas? What? I fixed your mole rat's leg. I noticed Snuffles limping, but I didn't realize the problem was that serious. Mate, Thanks. have you not seen what... That beast helps keep spirits... Have you not seen here. the problem? Ed. Need you to come back with me, mate. We're gonna be a... We're gonna be a big old happy family if you just... Yep. Come on, mate. Come on. Away from the giant death claw. Yeah, that other boy. Fucking hell. Oh, there's still feral ghouls, actually. Haven't seen any new creatures yet. I. I. I take back what I said. What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? No. Get away from him. What's up here? Hello? Nah. Nah, you can you can handle that, Boone. Nah, you, you 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 can Fuck off, mate. Cause thirty thousand damage with melee weapons, achievement unlocked. Some of the dead. What what Okay. And what were you? Demented Fuck, you look retarded. Just gonna... Just gonna... Eat this dead ghoul. There we go. What the fuck? The undead? Jesus. Oh, this place is gonna be a bit more fucked than I thought it is. Death poor hatchling is unconscious. Whoa, what the fuck is that? What? Boone! Boone, do something! Jesus fucking Christ. Boone. Boone, job, job for you. Job for you, mate. Job, job for you, mate. Yep, ju ju just, just kick his ass for me. All right, there we go. Thank you. Yep. It's all good. Uh... Bellas. Don't be scared now. He's just... Oh my god, you look like my nose. Fuck you. Right, that's fine. That's fine. We're just going to move on with our day. And pretend that none of this happened. Aww. Thanks, buddy. I didn't know he delivers you stuff. You can have a steak for that. Oh. Oh. He ate a stealth boy. Let's pick a name for you. Death Meat 
Binky, Shredder, Cuddles, Snuggles, Fluffy, Santa Claus, Clory, Higby, Meathead. What the fuck is that? Percival, Miggles, Billy, Pepper, Sergeant Schultz, Peaches, Muttley, Max, Tim, Sparky, Squinky, Godfrey. I mean, I could honor our chest breach and call him Mr. Cuddlesworth. But... Santa Claus? I like Santa Claus or Mr. Peepers. Miggles? Pigby? Ah, oh, fine, we'll go with Santa Claus. Hi, mate. Antler says you are the one killing my Ken. Antler says you must die. Well, I spoke to him, Bende. I didn't go to where well, that's a big sword. <laughs> Fuck you, your name's David. Fuck you, your name's David. Fuck you, David. You're dead. I you. Give me that big sword. That big sword sucks. You're hungry again. Jesus, fuck. I know it's a death claw, but come on. Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. Yep. There's where the rockets are. Who's down there? That's none of your business, smooth skin. Excuse me, Jason mate. was very clear. Get rid of the demons. I didn't speak back. to him. He didn't tell you to poke around down there. Got it. I really hope I haven't fucked the quest up by going the impromptu way. I'm going to guess you're the man to talk to. Hello, Wanderer. Oh, my Please God. Give us our humble surroundings. Our true home awaits us in the far beyond. Okay. Have you come to help us complete the great journey? Um, uh, who are you? I am Jason Bright. The prophet of the great journey. All the ghouls you see here are members of my flock. Yeah, that, that sounds yeah, that sounds pretty culty, actually. An auspicious name, don't you think? It was mine before I became as I am now. You're very the bright. War, even. Truly does the creator author a destiny for each and every one of us. Tell me more about these demons. The demons appeared from nowhere. Except it might be more accurate to say they never actually appeared at all. Uh, the demons are gone. Praise the creator and bless you, wanderer. The way is clear. I will lead my flock through the basement to the sacred site. I hope you will come find us there, wanderer. There is much to be done. All right, mate. You, oh, oh, okay. All right, bye, mate. I waited to speak with you one last time. You are to the launch pad. very fuck ugly, mate. I want you to know that we will remember for all eternity how you delivered us to the threshold of the great journey. All right, mate. Our preparations are nearly complete, but the rockets that will carry us to salvation are yet missing vital components. If you would still help us, Wanderer, speak to Chris. He can tell you what is missing. There is no way that we can thank you enough, Wanderer. Your arrival here was a blessing. We will remember you always. All right, mate. Cheers. Um, let's talk about Chris. After all that you have done for us, I suppose you deserve to know everything. When Chris came to us, we tried to convince him that he was human. But this only angered him. He seemed lost. We decided to let him stay with us for a few days, over the course of which we learned that his technical skills far surpassed our own. It became clear that the Creator had sent him to us to ensure the success of the great journey. Equally clear was that Chris should labor in blessed ignorance of his humanity and his inability to make the journey himself. It is no coincidence that two humans have been vital to the success of the great journey. It is my belief that the Creator sent you and Chris to expiate the sins of your kind against mine. Your Redeemers both. I'm going to tell him he's fucking smooth, mate. What do you think about that? Right, Chris. Jason says that I am to cooperate with you on I the final I don't task like your voice. Launch the great journey. Uh, how can I help? I was close to completing work on the rockets before we were driven into hiding on the top floor. Two components were missing. A quantity of isotope 239 igniting agent and a set of thrust control modules. 
The igniting agent is highly radioactive. I'm pretty sure I have those in the rockets from the gift shop, but I don't think I've got the other one. It's no longer potent enough. I need you to find an intact, shielded container of the igniting agent. As for the thrust control modules, they were custom built for these rockets. Oh, fucking fantastic. Uh, alright. Very well. We don't need a huge amount. Two to three liters should be enough. Uh, what about these rocket souvenirs? Yes, that's Isotope 239, all right. And there's enough here to launch the rockets. You're welcome, now mate. All I need is the thrust control modules. Why don't they let you work down on the launch pad? When I joined the flock, Jason made it clear that he wanted me to supervise the repairs. Oh, yeah. I do them mm. myself. That's interesting. It would be a waste of my gifts to work on just one system at a time. From up here, I've been able to supervise the entire project. Yeah, yeah, um, oh, oh. The radiation down there will kill you, Chris, because you're smooth. I thought we were past all that smooth skin. But you just can't resist the chance to mess with me. Typical human. I was human once, you know. Grew up in Vault 34, northeast of here. Interesting. Nice upbringing if you like assault rifles and target practice. But oh, you prefer machines that don't shoot people? Not so nice then. You left your vault because you were going bald. Bald? You call this bald, smooth skin? I'm a monster. A monster! I didn't know that bald people felt this way. Do all bald people feel like ghouls? Jason told me himself the great journey is for ghouls only. You're not going. Yeah, fuck you, Chris. Oh, God. You're telling me the truth, aren't you? Oh no. How could they do this to me? For two years? My god, I've been a joke to them. Do you have any idea how easy it'd be for me to sabotage those rockets? That'd be a joke, huh? One hell of a joke. Uh, don't do that, Chris. What, you think I'm too stupid to pull it off? I know enough to get their rockets working, don't I? So I can make them fail, too. Uh, it's not a matter of smarts, mate. Don't, don't do it, please. Like I could forgive myself for getting duped like this? They used me, and now they'll throw What are you me doing away. with your eyes? They'd take you if they could, Chris, but you'd die. And dying would be worse than this? Used up and thrown away like garbage? Ah, uh, you're gonna be a saint. Oh, so I've redeemed the human race, is that it? What a crock. The human race can't stand me. Ah, you're you're all right. So, you want me to accompany you on your adventures across the wasteland, is that it? No, 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 I don't. Go to Novak. Life among humans again? That's what you're suggesting? I guess. I guess it's the only chance I've got. I can't believe I'm agreeing to this, but I'll give it a try. I'll get Jason and his flock on their way. And then I'll head for Novak. All right, mate. I need to wait. Can I? No, no, Jason. Well, he's gone. What the fuck? Evening. Oh my god, those things can be NPCs. Hey. Oh, that thing's disgusting. What kind of machinery do you like to finger? I, uh, I think you can have a little old rummage round on my boots, couldn't you, mate? Couldn't you? Eh? Eh? I didn't know I could move you. Um, I went ahead and changed our special, uh, autism fucking, you know, our brain cells about. I mushed them around like they were made of bangers and mash. Bangers of- bangers of mash? Bangers and mash in my brain. Please let me out. Please let me out. The voices don't stop. Yeah, we're stupid now. Uh, this was seven, it's now one, so I just reallocated that into endurance and luck, so. We're, uh, I, I, I just really wanted to be retarded, you know? I just, I had a craving. I had a really, really big craving for retard soup. Hello? Service, please. Hello, I'd like a cervix, please. Is there anyone here? Oh, an old lady and a baseball bat. Hello? Be taking that. Don't mind me. 
Can I club an old lady to death in her sleep? Would that be wrong? I feel like it'd be a bit wrong. Hey. Hi. Hi there. I'm old lady Gibson, or so they tell me. I've got odds and ends for sale, and I'm pretty good at fixing things too. Why did I just you get a quest for Eddie? Just north of here. That's Helios One. The NCR runs Piss. this place, so it's off. Why, why Streamlabs? Shut up. Welcome to the stream, Oscar. Good to have you. Uh, looking for rocket parts, thrust models, or something. Got any? As it so happens, I do have some thrust modules. You but bitch. Five hundred caps worth of expensive. Diagnosis complete. Jeez, why? Why? Whitley. I'm a researcher at Adams Air Force Base. Until recently, I was in charge of the Duraframe reinforcement project for the combat model iBots. Why are you just creeping around the corner, Eddie? Why? Why? What? What are you doing? iBot Duraframe Subject E is both the prototype and the last functional model in this test group. I was prepared to make several significant upgrades to the machines. However, as the project was canceled, I'll tune into that one properly. Too busy at the moment. Have a glorious stream, big man. No problem, everywhere. I'm glad that you could step in and crush my nuts with money. It was very nice of you. I hope you have a good rest of your day. Look at Boone's face. I don't... I, I know I'm trapped in dialogue, so time has frozen. But my god. He looks like he has mumps. The, the disease, not, not like mumps to live. I guess he would also have mumps to live. If you're listening to this log from one of our Enclave outposts in Chicago, give this unit whatever repairs it needs. So it can oh, he's got Enclave arm. fucking data on him. Right. I'm gonna steal your Abroxo cleaner. I can't, I'm detected. Um, yeah, I've had a change of heart with where this character's going. I, I thought it would be really funny to make him really stupid, but also really attractive. As you can see from our stats, we're a very gorgeous retard. You know, it's it. Uh, there's no stopping us. But also, we're gonna be really fucking evil because I just really want to be evil. A any time I play a Bethesda game, I try to be evil. But any time it comes to like insulting an NPC, I like. I'm just like, oh, I can't, I can't do it. He's too cute. I can't tell him that I killed his whole family. So this time, we're sticking to it. We're gonna be a real asshole. Have you found the components we discussed? I did, mate. I did. Here you go. Indeed, you did, and they seem to be in excellent condition. I wonder if I can make him look like a ghoul. Yes, I'll tell Jason that the great journey can begin. All right, mate. Sweet. Let's let's come on, come on. Speed things up a bit. Oh, God, I forgot about the, like, other enemies I added to the game. I don't like... Th this feels like... This feels like a porno version of the Teletubbies. Where the fuck's the viewing platform? Is it back in the building? Right. Go be celibate. Really? You didn't even go that far. You could sexually grate me if you want. Use a cheese grater, make me feel like a real boy. I would read all of this to you like a bedtime story, but one, I don't think any of you give a shit, and two, that would take about, it is hungry. It, that would take about like, I don't know, 20 minutes. Hey, this is the viewing platform. Right, okay. Uh, activate launch button. Uh, you've had enough fun time with the cheese grater, Brock and Ross. Please return my cheddar and red Lester. No, mate, I need it for my... Cock. I need it for my cheesy cock. Famous cock nicknames? Uh, mine smells like cheddar. What do you mean that wasn't the game? What does this do? You see a bunch of numbers and words on the screen, but none of it really means anything to you. I'm gonna mash on the keys. You don't think you accomplished much, but you feel better? <laughs> mash on the keys again. How many times can I mash on the keys? Alright. Fine, I guess. Off they go. To the great beyond, the far beyond, they're going to Florida. Come fly with me, more like come dine with me in Florida. I'll feed you some alligator stew, and maybe my uh, husband Brian will do you in the arse. Does that sound appetizing? Would you like that? I'd like that. 
Off they go. I really thought mashing on the keys would have done something. Why did you play Rip? Did you think they were going to blow up? I'm liked in Novak, and that's also the first time I've done the quest on PC. Jesus Christ. God damn it. That was not what I was hoping for. I wanted a big boom. Alright, I leveled up, but I'm not leveling up. What's going on? Is there an enemy? Oh, okay, All right, that was a bit, bit delayed, mate. What should I put our points into? I don't know how this is going to go since I reduced our intelligence to one from seven. So I don't know if speech or science are going to be affected badly. Let's just do, let's just be a big bonking gentleman. Let's get our bonk on. Serious chat, guys. Get our bonk on. We've got to figure out where we're going in life. 